Dips is one of the most effective exercises for increasing muscle mass in the upper torso. In this video, I'll tell you what will happen to your body if you do 100 dips every day. So watch the video till the end, it will be interesting. Let's go! What muscles work during dips? When you do dips, the triceps, deltoid muscles, and pectoral muscles work most actively. By regularly performing dips, you will pump the above muscles, increase their volume and strength, as well as the speed of hit. Many martial arts or weightlifting athletes actively include dips in their training program for this very reason. Let's move on to the main advantages of dips. Dips give a significant load on the chest and triceps, involve a large number of muscle fibers in the work, almost all groups of the upper body. Dips allow you to progress indefinitely, regardless of your fitness level using weights. Dips significantly increase strength and endurance. Thanks to dips, you can build natural muscles and improve muscle definition, strengthen tendons and ligaments. Dips not only don't create a negative compression effect on the vertebrae, but also relieves muscle hypertonicity due to to being in a hanging position. Also, an important feature of dips with an emphasis on the pectoral muscles is that the pectoralis major muscle receives an additional stretch. This promotes muscle growth and improves posture. Dips has no pronounced disadvantages, except for the need to perfectly follow the technique. Often athletes do dips at a fast pace with an emphasis on the number of times. But for the development of strength, mass and endurance, this option is less effective than the concentrated execution of movements at a moderate pace. Classic technique of dips. Jump onto the bars, grabbing them with your hands. Palms should be turned to the body. Take a deep breath. Slowly lower your body so that the angle at the elbows is 90 degrees. If it doesn't work, then lower yourself as far as you have flexibility. Make sure that the elbows are pressed to the body. Exhaling. Begin to extend your arms and lift your body up. If the exercise is very difficult, then fully extend the elbows and give a break to the muscles of the arms. But to increase the effectiveness of the exercise for the muscles of the back and chest, it is recommended to leave them slightly bent, keeping the tension in the muscles. The width of the grip determines the emphasis on the load on the muscles. If the bars are wide, this is a variant of dips for the pectoral muscles. It is considered more technically difficult and requires better physical fitness. Triceps dips are performed with a narrow grip. For this, a simulator is suitable, in which the crossbars are located closer to each other. If there is only one simulator in the gym or on the site, and the width of the crossbar cannot be changed, the emphasis is shifted to different muscles by tilting the body. For the exercise to be as effective as possible, you must adhere to the basic recommendations. It is important to understand which muscles pump and dips. This will allow you to perform the movements correctly. The back should always be straight. Slouching shoulders on roundness of the upper back will lead to increased stress on the vertebrae and increase the risk of injury. Exhalation is always carried out during the ascent. Also, to increase the productivity of movement, it is necessary to concentrate tension on the muscles. This will improve neuromuscular communication and increase the overall benefits of exercise. If doing exercises is counterindicated for medical or other reasons, then only safe movements that load the same muscle areas can replace it, for example a classic bench press or a dumbbell bench press. For athletes who cannot perform exercises on the uneven bars, these movements will serve as an excellent base for increasing strength and technically correct performance of all elements. When the technique for performing dips is well mastered, you can begin to do it with weights. It can be a chain hanging around the neck or leg weights. This version of the exercise is used by bodybuilders in order to not only increase muscle mass in the thoracic region, but also significantly improve the muscle definition. By the way, friends, be sure to watch other videos on this channel. The links are on the screen right now. See you soon!